Hey everyone, welcome to Wabiscape. Today we're going to be aquascaping this two gallon rimless tank from my bookshelf. These two large stones are going to be the main focal point of the hardscape. They're rather large and look like they belong next to each other, as if they were once one piece. To get a sense of scale, I'm going to add a few smaller rocks to add balance as well as make the larger stones seem even larger. The smaller stones give a sense of scale. Without them, we won't have the same dramatic effect. Be careful to not add too many stones as it can quickly become unbalanced. Next, I'm going to be adding a thin layer of decorative sand. Remember to keep it thinner at the front and sloping towards the back of the tank. It adds a sense of depth, which is going to be very important in such a narrow tank as this one. I'm also going to be adding some gravel. It helps add character and interest, as well as break up the harsh line between the sand and the stones. It also adds to the sense of scale in the overall design. In between the two larger stones, I've added some Christmas moss. I also added a few cuttings of hydrocodal tripartita. I'm also going to add this little bucephalandra bonsai to the top. I felt that it added to the overall feel of the scape, and it helped to create that floating mountain feel I was going for. Well, now that we're done with the planning, let's fill up the tank. I wanted to create a scene similar to something you might see in the movie Avatar. With two stones that look almost as though they were once one piece. And that over time as it was eroded, the moss found its way into the cracks. I've had this little tank for a while now, trying to figure out what to do with it. It turned out to be a perfect fit for my little bookshelf here. I felt as though the space was missing something, and I really wanted to fill it with an aquarium. So I set out to create something that could have a huge impact in such a small amount of space. So if you have limited space and a small budget, you can still have a fun, dramatic, and impactful aquascape. Thanks for watching everyone, and be sure to like this video and subscribe if you want to see more like this. See you next time and stay inspired.